Welcome back to Bags on the Go. And this is going to be an update on the GMC Caballero. I'm a little let down right now, but when it comes down to these cars, situations like this is going to happen. So the best thing you can do is, is to not let it get to you because you can't control what you can't control. And you can't speed up what you want to speed up. You can't have what you don't do yourself. And my problem is, my job is done. Everything that I needed to do on this car, I'm waiting on interior. I don't have interior. It's the middle of June right now. Um, only thing I can do is shoot for uh, July 13th for the G-Body show in Ohio to pretty much showcase the car finish there. If it don't happen there, we're going to shoot for... Uh, Wilbur Dream Cruise. Um, that's about it, man. Uh, if you're going to be building cars, be patient. Don't be setting dates to get done by. I got to have my car by. Because when it don't happen, you're going to be let down. And in the, the day, you're going to wish you just really never even look forward to it. Just let it be. And whenever it comes, it's finished. It's finished. So... What I'm about to do today is get this car back up on jack stands and raise it up and start it. It ain't been started in a couple of weeks now, so I need to raise it up because I'm tired of the fenders hitting the, uh, hitting the wheels. And I just, I was looking at this style for the last couple of weeks and I'm like, this ain't it. I know everybody was suggesting uh, lower the rear down, do this, do that. To me, it's a, it's, a, it's a small truck, so I need it to ride high. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna raise it back up. It's gonna sit right here for a minute, and that's just what it's gonna be. Um, I got some good news. I got some good news as well. Um, I called the guy that do my sand, my wet sanding on the cars. I asked him, hey, when do you want to come out so we can do this wet sanding? And I haven't been getting much luck. I try to give him a lot of time. I, I've been contacting him since February, just letting him know, hey, I got one, let me know. And me and him, we can't get on the same page. He busy when I'm free, I'm busy when he free. I got to work during the day. I can't, I can't get on this car and start rubbing it out. That stuff gonna be all in the air. It's gonna be getting my tent jobs. It can't happen, so we can't coordinate a time together. So I say, you know what? I called my buddy up, Tim. I said, Tim, look, check this out. I got a moment to learn. Oh, what you want to learn? I'll teach you. I said, wet sand. I, I want to learn the steps. I want to learn everything and how it goes. You know, I'm not going to be able to show that uh, experience that most guys that's been doing this and do this stuff on a daily will but the more and more I do it and just being able to know how to do it, I'm pretty sure I can work with it, get all my tools, get the supplies and just go at it. And you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, I did it, so I'll be proud of it. I said, no problem, man. He said, uh, I sent my brother over there. My brother will show you, my brother is the best. That's all he do. I said, all right, so real soon, hopefully I can put a video together, show y'all what's going on. Uh, we're going to get to wet sand in this car and I'm going to do it myself and I ain't even going to worry about it. And, uh, you know, hey, it's mid-June. I'm trying to get to the finish line, y'all. I'm trying. I'm trying. But all I say is I'm happy to have cars so I ain't stuck just trying to have a car come out this year. I'm still enjoying my green car, still taking that thing to shows. And this car is just going to be on ice. So... You know, no wear and tear on it right now. And I don't have to go through a situation when I'm trying to fix that car as well as drive this car. And this car, is it got me on the ground because I'm trying to fix it and get it back out the door. It's all right. Everything going to play out is going to work out. I'm going to have all the time when I get a chance to put this car back together. I'm going to have the perfect time for it. So uh, that's the that's the update on this car. I know y'all wondering. By now, right? By now. I ain't seen no... No reels, I ain't seen no videos of where the car at. A lot, a lot. Look, I'm proud, I'm happy of it. It's just, it's not my time right now. And the stuff that I had 
in works is just moving slow and what do you want me to do man building cars it ain't easy it ain't easy so be patient i know you want things to come out right away it takes time you may have to start all the way up all the way over and it just happens so just be patient so oh let's get into it might go ahead do a cold start She ain't been started. She need, she needs some key. I got you. Yep. So, if you want to see my seat? There go my seat right there. I'm trying to finish my sounds. I got all the sounds partially hooked up and everything. It's just it's all right. Bad baby, smooth. You don't even hear this thing running. trying to drive it i'm just trying to drive it just saying cars ain't in play so what do you want me to do so what i'm about to do is go ahead and put it right here straight and then we're gonna go ahead and jack it up and uh let me sh let me show you all where this fender is hitting though because that's bugging me Right there. And I don't want to change the tires. I don't want to. And the tires that I will have to change it to is the ones that's over here on my slingshot. I like them a little better. These are thicker. These are... Um, 255 and these are 65 so you see right there I just I don't I don't want to do it don't want to do it Nothing 
that the time is right. So until then, it's all been work about what I can change. All right, so I'm about to go ahead. I still gotta clean, I'm trying to clean up this area a little bit cause I got this new motor. Now I gotta push everything over to the side, get them tires out of here, throw them in my van, little stuff. All right, so follow me, let's get into it. So this is how she will sit. It's gonna settle a little bit in the front, however, I got them fenders off some tires back there. Well, they wasn't on the tire, but they were close to the tire. So what I'm saying is, it's above the tire. Sitting up, it looks a lot better. And me, I'm just learning what you want, like far as looks when it comes to suspension, may not work when you drive the car. So you gotta sit the car on the springs. So when I was raising it back up, I go, I don't even know why I did this. I guess I just, I love that lower look so much, but I already know ideally it ain't gonna work. That weight needs to ride on those springs or this thing will be another bouncy ride. So, and I like it, I like it sitting up. It just looks bossy like that, raised up in the air. So, uh, for now, update, little small stuff like that. And uh, I got another weekend enjoy with uh, another car of mine. We got some cruises this weekend, well, no, a cruise this weekend, and a father's uh, car show this weekend as well. So Saturday, I'm gonna start off in the slingshot. I got a Saturday event for the slingshot, Ohio versus Michigan, or Michigan versus Ohio. All the slingshots are gonna meet up at one place, uh, I believe it's a, it's not Dave and Buster's, it's one of those places off of Hall Road in Macomb. Um, so that's where we're gonna meet. So expect like probably a hundred or so slingshots. That's, that's, that does a lot of damage on the road. <laughs> so we're gonna start off in the slingshot. Then I'm gonna take this home. I'm gonna hop into Malibu and the grass shirt cruise east point grasher cruise is this weekend and then i'm gonna go through there probably hang out for a little bit and hang it up from there so saturday saturday eventful turn around sunday morning father's day uh another car show is gonna be in belleville and i'm going to take the malibu there and womp, 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 womp. this car i just Man, people gonna let you down, man. You just you gotta have tough skin. You gotta be tough about it. And they gonna they gonna let you down. Nobody care about your progress, but you. So on that note, with this car, y'all, that's what we waiting on. Beat your interior works. Hey, I can't call it. So hey, it'll just stay on ice. So I got the rubbing out process. I'm gonna learn that. And then once we done with that, hopefully the interior be here soon and we'll move on, go get the alignment, get it tuned, get it outside, start rolling it around. Um, I still I still got big plans for this car, so I just don't want to uh, say, oh, I ain't doing nothing for the rest of the year with this car. No, this car is done. The car is ready to go out the door real soon. It's just waiting on one small step for me to complete. So once that's done, we're gonna move on. So this bag's gonna go. I appreciate y'all for watching. It's just more small clips of what I'm doing, what I got going on. Like the video, subscribe if you're not. Appreciate for watching. Peace.